Hello friends, welcome back to my channel Techno Education Academy. In this video lecture, we will discuss about engine exhaust brake. Okay, it is an auxiliary brake and it is used with the service brake. It is used with the air brake. It is generally used in all types of Tata vehicle. Here we will uh, see the different components of the uh, engine exhaust brake. The first component is engine. Okay, this engine it is connected with the compressor. It is generally driven by belt drive. We know that compressor means it is an input device. It will receive the power from the engine and this compressor it will compress the air and this compress air it is stored in the compressor air tank. Okay, it is one type of reservoir. It will store the air at high pressure and this air compressor tank it is connected with the uh, pressure regulator. Okay, this is the main component of the engine exhaust brake. It will operate the uh, service brake. Here you can see that uh, it is connected with the two brake valves. Okay, means it will supply the air, high pressure air to the service brake as well as it will also supply the high pressure air to the air cylinder. Means it is the main component of the engine exhaust brake. It will supply the high pressure air to the service brake as well as it will operate the engine exhaust brake. The next component is food control valve. Okay, it is connected with the uh, pedal, brake pedal. Then after air cylinder, then after linkage, this linkage it is connected with the uh, butterfly valve and as well as it is connected with the uh, link to fuel cutoff means governor or we can say it is a throttle valve. Okay, it will control the fuel supply. Now we will discuss the working principle of the engine exhaust brake, how it's work. First of all, whenever you apply the brake through the food pedal, so at that time it will operate the food control valve. This food control valve, okay, it will also apply the brake uh, to the uh, braking valves uh, as a primary braking system and uh, the high pressure air from the pressure regulator, it is supplied to the air cylinder. This air cylinder, it will operate this linkage and through this linkage, okay, it will partially close the butterfly valve. Here you can see that, okay, in the exhaust manifold, okay, it is a butterfly valve and this butterfly valve, it is operated by the air cylinder through the linkage. So, what's happened? Okay, we know that in an IC engine, okay, through the exhaust valve, okay, whenever the piston will travel from bottom dead center to top dead center at that time, there is a high pressure, it will be generated inside the cylinder and the exhaust valve, it will open. Okay, and this exhaust valve, okay, through the, and through this exhaust valve, okay, the exhaust gases, okay, it is uh, exposed into the atmosphere. So, here, through this linkage, we partially close this butterfly valve. So, what's happened? Okay, it will uh, prevent uh, the flow of exhaust gases through the exhaust valve because here uh, we operate this butterfly valve and uh, uh, it is partially closed. So at that time small amount of the exhaust gases it is exhausted into the atmosphere and the remaining gases inside the cylinder it will create the back pressure on the piston. Okay, so it will slow down the movement of the piston because of the pressure built up. So finally. Uh, whenever we uh, partially close the exhaust valve, so it will slow down uh, the movement of the piston due to the pressure built up into the cylinder. And this air cylinder, it will also operate okay, the throttle valve. And the throttle valve, uh, here the fuel supply is cut off or we can say reduce the fuel supply. So our final, our objective is to save the fuel for the economy point of view. And generally this type of braking system, it is used in the vehicle uh, when Okay, the necessity uh, to apply the braking system continuously, like as in uh, traffic area. Okay, so uh, in heavy traffic, okay, this type of uh, engine exhaust brake system is used in the Tata vehicle to save the fuel. So it is an economical brake. So remember, guys, okay, this engine exhaust brake it will not operate the brake, but it will save the fuel. So to operate the brake, here you can see that, 
okay uh, here uh, pressure regulator it will also supply the air to the brake wall so this is the overview about the uh, working principle of the engine exhaust brake i hope this information it will be helpful to you if you would like to watch this type of more technical videos then please subscribe our channel and also share with your friends